you guys. I'm coming at you looking really scary at the beginning of this vlog. Rachel and I are doing sheet masks tonight. This is the Petrology Illuminate Brightening whatever mask we got at Marshall's for like $2. It's really wet and we look like serial killers. But um, yeah, we're just kind of doing our own thing because it's pretty late. It's Sunday night. I'm just watching YouTube. I'm watching Jamie, her empties video and looking at more masks on Sephora, so it's just kind of a chill night. Oh my god, I always forget about Game of Thrones. That's on now. Um, maybe I should watch that after I take my mask off. Maybe I'll watch it, but yeah, I'm so sad the weekend's almost over, but gotta get on that work grind tomorrow, so uh, that shall be interesting to wake up early <laughs> and uh yeah i just wanted to show you guys this insane looking mask so we're taking off the mask it still feels like wet yeah like on my cheeks but not on my lip yeah this one dried out really fast mm -hmm. i think we're breathing on it so <laughs> yeah so let's see it's so much easier to remove <laughs> yeah mmm nice and wet <laughs> I liked it though. Yeah. It feels so relaxing. So here's my question to you guys. So we're obsessed with masks now. And now I'm Googling uh, Korean beauty subscription boxes. So if you guys know of any, please let us know because that would be so fun. I just found really one cool. range that's like only like 10 bucks a month and you get like four masks. That's awesome. So. Yeah, please let us know because we're balls deep obsessed with this stuff. <laughs> like, so I feel like that stuff, like when it dries, it's kind of like tacky. It's like a serum, I guess. Yeah. So then we've been using. Well, Rachel loves this. The Colleen <laughs> Rothschild um, intense hydrating mask. We just do like a hydrating mask. Here you go. On top of, um, whatever. Like after we do the first mask. You could just use like a rich moisturizer as well, but that's what we have been doing as like our <laughs> routine. And there's so much stuff I want to try, but like I don't want to spend a million dollars. So They're always expensive. <laughs> yeah, like we want to try a sleeping pack, which is that just kind of like a moisturizer like i feel like yeah. half of this is just marketing yeah like it's... sleeping pack isn't that just like a moisturizing step yeah. but maybe you guys know what like the story is behind that and why it's different and stuff if it has like more like water content or something like hyaluronic acid but please let me know i just found one that's like a neck and chest mask i thought that was really cool yeah. Um, I some more for your feet to make them softer. I have some of those. Oh, sweet. I had them before, but I think they might be, like, expired because it didn't really seem to work. But I have two more, so we can try those. Also, like, hand masks. That would be cool. Like, hand sheet masks. Yeah. I don't know if that exists. I think I've seen those. We got, well, in my um, Peach and Lily order, I got, like, lip masks that are just, like, mm -hmm. I don't know really what it's supposed to do, but then... Like, obviously hydrate, but it's yeah. gonna, like, close your mouth, so we have to... I don't know, it seems kind of weird. And there's this one product by Laneige that's, like, a hydrating overnight treatment. Rachel found it on Peach and Lily, but then they have it for $5 less at Sephora. So, I don't know why that really is. It was really good. Like, yeah, it was seems amazing. good, and it has, like, a cool applicator. Mm-hmm. So that's that. There's one product I didn't show it to you yet, but it's called like a um, watermelon glow sleeping pack or whatever the hell. Um, we saw it at Sephora when we were looking. Okay. It's like that pretty like pink gel stuff. Because when we smelled yeah. it, I was like, we should give it to Pop Up because he got yeah. that watermelon drink. <laughs> so, yeah, we just have so much so many ideas so much stuff we want to get and we haven't even got our first <laughs> order we have three orders coming from peach and lily and none of them are even like close to being shipped so yeah let us know about the subscription boxes that's the most important thing you have to tell us okay yes. thank you <laughs> 
Hey you guys, so it is Monday night. I just got back from work and I went to the bathroom and stuff like that. And now I am going out to Torre, which is one of my favorite restaurants. It, it's like my favorite restaurant, but it's also one I have a love-hate relationship with because I only like very specific things there. But they have happy hour with $2 tacos and like cheaper margaritas. So I'm just gonna go sit at the bar by myself. Hopefully no one bothers me. I've honestly never gone to a bar by myself, but I want these tacos so damn bad. And then at 7.30, I'm going to see Atomic Blonde because Michael really wanted to see it and he asked me to go tonight and he's going where he works. So we're seeing it alone but together at the same time, which is really like cute and so dorky and corny but really really sweet and then we're gonna talk about it afterwards we love like watching the same thing at the same time and then discussing it even when we're apart so um yeah i'm gonna do that it's kind of like an alone date but also like a date with michael who's not even here but i wanted to show you guys um the one lipstick that i got at marshall's i hope this camera angle is okay um but this is the um luminous cream lipstick in zen which was only seven dollars at marshall's that's crazy right and i just love this color and the formula is so nice my makeup my eye makeup is a little like heavier than I've been doing lately I kind of went a little bit overboard today but it was fun I used this like little Lancome palette that Aunt Sue had given me and the Melt Cosmetics stack the like sparkly smoky one and I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm wearing the L'Oreal Pro Glow on my face. So it's definitely a glowy look. And I'm wearing one of the dresses I got from Marshalls. So I'm like all marshalled up. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited for these tacos. I have tried pretty much all of them. And so I like have it narrowed down to the ones I really, really like. And so I'm going to get their fish tacos and like the brisket are really good. So I start with like three and then I might get like one additional if I really, really like a certain one. And today apparently is National Avocado Day. So maybe I'll get some guac. I don't know. Just going with the flow. And I don't go out by myself very much. So this is really fun. I used to do this so often before I was like dating Michael or like dating anyone. <laughs> and now it's, it's nice to be dating someone of course, but it's nice to have alone time as well so that is what I am up to and I will show you guys my food and beverage when I get there oh my god look at all this you guys <laughs> it's gonna be so good you guys I literally just wanted a small popcorn and a small drink <laughs> and ended up with these grace. large ass drinks and popcorn because it was only like 8 50 to get both instead of like 15 to get two smalls I don't understand the stub stuff but it's so awesome Hey you guys, so tonight I'm making this meal from HelloFresh, the Southwest Steak Tacos, and it has fancy kiwis in it. It's these sun gold kiwis, so I'm excited about that. Here's, we're gonna get rid of the cilantro because to us it tastes like soap. Here's all the ingredients, avocados, yummy looking peppers, and tortillas. Seems like it's gonna be, oh, and the steak. I love when they send this steak that's like all chopped up already. Wow, it's amazing and so easy. But I think this is gonna be a quick preparation and super, super yummy and delicious. Rachel's the pro avocado it's chopper in the fam. Mom's good at it too. Well, I feel like you do it like for fun, like as a oh, hobby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rachel's a hobbyist at avocado. Ooh, these are like perfectly. Uh, I know. I don't know how to get this part off. There. <laughs> That's how professionals do it. Be so careful, oh my god. These are like perfectly right. I know. Yeah. Sometimes we get them and they're like super mush. hard. Or oh, mush. Yeah. yeah, this is gonna go in the salsa with the kiwis. I think we'll just do two of the kiwis and save two just to eat for, mm. for fun. And then I have the 
onions and poblanos in here just sauteing up. And I feel like I have a hard time sauteing stuff. Like my mom does it perfectly and I just have a little bit of difficulty. So I'm trying to get better at it. But like honestly, this meal is so easy. All we have left to do is the salsa and then just cooking the beef and then it's like done. So I just love tacos. I know. Tacos, 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 tacos. Especially with the kiwis. Mm. That's going to be delicious. Tacos last night for me and tacos tonight. Pretty sweet. Look at that finesse. Ooh. Yum. We've already been stirring it as we go. Doing better at the <laughs> the onions and the peppers. I add a little bit of water. And then we have the steak going with the Southwestern seasoning. And I must have like blown my nose and kind of like picked my nose <laughs> with my hands that had like the pepper oils on them because my nose is like burning so bad. So that's been fun. <laughs> Yeah, all I did was add salt and pepper, and that's how I made this whole meal. <laughs> <laughs> that's all this is. Salt, salt and pepper. pepper. <laughs> so here's the final look. Mom charred the tortillas. Yummy. Salsa by Rachel, and we had rice, because there's no, like, side, which is kind of weird, but we always have rice. So it looks delicious. Can't wait to eat it. P.S. We know that this is called guac. <laughs> We've been saying salsa all night. <laughs> Rachie's taking me for a ride. She hates me. <laughs> I never get to be a passenger in my car. I'm not going to vlog you driving. I have to be your instructor. It's... <laughs> she knows exactly how to drive. It's just rare for her to drive my car. Have you ever driven this car yet? No. Oh wow. Fun, fun first time. It's the safest car ever. This is my favorite K-pop right now. Never Ever by God7. And Rachel's doing a great job driving. <laughs> you guys should give her encouragement in the comments. Don't. <laughs> Do it! <laughs> Rachel did a great job driving you guys and we went to Target because I did a online pickup order. I've never done that before. I got a big thing of puffs plus lotion, the only tissues I like. Um, I got two new beauty things and one repurchase. I've been wanting just like a red like auburn brow gel and I don't really want to buy the Anastasia ones. So I looked up drugstore ones and they had this one by Maybelline. It's the Brow Precise Fiber Volume. And it's like this little comb. Looks interesting. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm almost out of my eye makeup remover. So I thought I would give one of these a shot. This is the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. All in one removes makeup, even waterproof mascara. Because I've been wearing waterproof mascara lately. So... We will see how this goes. I'm really uh, skeptical, honestly, so we'll see. And then the repurchase is the Rimmel Match Perfection. Um, it's like a highlighter and concealer, and I get the shade 230 Fair Light. So with these, you guys, you need to be very careful because there's no seal. So the one that was in like the Target pickup bag like that the person like got together and I was just supposed to pick it up and leave. It had been like opened and squeezed and it was disgusting. So thankfully they had one left on the counter, on the display I mean, that wasn't already used. But you guys need to check all makeup that you buy in store to make sure that it wasn't opened and messed with because so much of it is, it's absolutely disgusting. So that's like a PSA. But that is my super mini Target haul. All right, so tonight we're doing two different masks. Mm -hmm. Rachel is using this one um, from Marshalls. And it's like you mix it up because it's yeah. like a powder. And it comes with a spatula. Do you need it? Yeah, it's in water. I can't tell if it's to the line or not, but it's close. So cool. I think it needs more. 
water. <laughs> well, not anymore because we just lost some. Remember, you need to spread it, so maybe yeah. she should get some more water. Oh my god, just do it. <laughs> I learned in cooking, sometimes you need more water than you think. <laughs> this is like a pour clearing out mask. Yeah, and there's charcoal in it. Cool. And I'm gonna do, well first I'm gonna do this Andalou Naturals pumpkin and honey. It's a single use and then after we do those two we're gonna do the sheet masks, which one of my subscribers sent me a long time ago. I'm finally getting use out of these sheet masks. Maybe we'll do eye masks too. Yeah. That'd be fun. But I'll show you guys when we put them on. <laughs> do I look like Trump <laughs> with my orange face? <laughs> it's like tingly a little bit. It's a glycolic, so it definitely has like a punch to it. And it's only 10 minutes. Rachel's still applying hers. Mm -hmm. There's so much in that thing. We yeah, could have easily oh, both done yeah. it, but I don't know. I didn't really want to do that one. I don't like clay masks usually, but so we're going to let this set and hopefully my face doesn't burn off and then we're going to do the sheet masks. Okay, so we think that Rachel's supposed to feel hers. I think this is like the rubber mask. Oh my god, this is amazing. <laughs> I'm snapchatting like, and <laughs> but like feel it. I don't know who you want. Whoa! Right? Okay, so if you guys see this at Marshall's, get this shit. It was only three dollars. Yeah. And I can't wait to see what your face looks like though. after. Yeah, you would definitely get two uses. Man, now I wish I did it. Oh well. I still have some left. I'm gonna do three masks in a row. I'm sure that's great for your yeah, skin. Yeah, definitely not. Whoa. <laughs> I like awesome. this one a lot. This is probably my favorite. Good thing I ordered a bunch of different rubber and water <laughs> gel masks. <sighs> now so I have to cool. take my Trump mask off. I think my face looks pretty good. Pretty. Yeah. Pretty good. Yeah, I would definitely get that. That's all natural and it smelled good. It smelled like pumpkin pie. And I would say it honestly has similar results to the Tata Harper resurfacing mask. It's a similar um, like effect and also the all natural thing. And Rachel's mask was so cool, that rubbery yeah. type of texture. So yeah, two thumbs up for those. Yeah. And then now we're gonna do the sheet masks. <laughs> I always feel so scary. <laughs> we put the eye mask first. And then the sheet mask on top. This one doesn't, it's like weird in the chin. It has like a <laughs> cut out. <laughs> oh, my hair got in there nice. <laughs> I would definitely give this one a thumbs up. And Rachel used the tea tree one. And yeah, I liked it. I don't know, it just kind of made like my skin just like nice and like plump and I love it. I can't believe I never liked face masks before. <laughs> now you're this is so fun. <laughs> You guys, I just went berserk this morning. It's like 7.15 in the morning. And so I'm going to DC this weekend. And I was like, I need to find that damn Venus Snap Razor. I know it's in one of my travel bags. So I literally pulled out all of my travel bags. Look at all these travel bags, you guys. This is ridiculous. I need to declutter them now that I see how many I have. And there was stuff in, like, several of them. So I found so much stuff. I'm so excited. And I found the freaking Venus Snap Razor. I love this thing. It's so nice because do you see how there's, like, holes in here? It, like, dries itself because it can air out. It's just perfect for traveling. It was on sale at Ulta on the last time I checked. So I'll link it below. But I found, like... A travel size toothpaste, cotton, like, um, Q-tip. You guys know I needed more, um, 
travel size shampoo and stuff. I found that. Uh, some moisturizer samples, the CeraVe moisturizing cream, little travel sizes, eye cream, Lancome Bifacil travel size, um, Kiehl's Midnight Recovery travel size, tissues, um, allergy pills, one of my favorite face washes, um, another face wash, and tons of hair clips. So I'm just like, this is insane. I can't believe I had all this amazing stuff just like hidden away. Like, this is crazy. So I'm definitely going to declutter these um, today and just get rid of like probably most of these because I don't need too many. But yeah, I just had to show you I found this freaking razor. A baby in the back. I was like so <laughs> careful. Like, don't, don't mess up the macchiatos. Oh my god, they're gorgeous. Yeah, sure. Look, so they're both the mocha. Yeah. Here's mocha mocha, and mocha. <laughs> mocha, mocha, mocha. Now you're sitting and not being crazy. <laughs> licky dee, licky dee. It's basically <laughs> their menu caramel macchiato, but with mm. mocha drizzle instead of caramel. Oh my god. So when I ordered it, I said like um, sugar free vanilla syrup mm -hmm. and mocha drizzle. They're like, do you want the caramel drizzle too? I was like, no. Uh, not just <laughs> so what's the difference between macchiato and an iced coffee again there's more milk it's like the milk's on the bottom Ooh. and then I think they say like it's called macchiato because that means to mark in a different language like probably Italian yeah. and then like they pour the espresso in the top and it, like makes a hole in the milk and then it like just so settles cool. on the top and then they do the drizzle on that like just it's it just so it weird delicious. how it doesn't like blend it's I like, know, I know it it's like magic separated like that. wow I am so <laughs> thrilled to eat this so it's car or it's mocha and vanilla yeah because cool. like their menu caramel macchiato mm. has vanilla syrup mm. on the bottom so I just figured it was let's good do last it time, yeah so. <laughs> I think I just got milk <laughs> The milk tastes good. <laughs> yeah, you got it mixed up now. Mm. So it's like layers. So once yeah. you get to the bottom, you that's taste really the coffee cool. Ones, so yeah, okay. Buy them. me one free. Yeah, look at the side by side. Okay. <laughs> Do you want one? You'll go crazy. <laughs> Cannibal! If she ate one. <laughs> And we have to do Domino's delivery pizza our first I know, time. My mom might do it with us. So. She's so like, do excited. they deliver here? And oh. like, my dad said that he saw a car here. Okay. And I looked on the website. It was closed this morning when I tried, but I'm pretty sure. So, I know. I can't believe I've never ordered delivery in my life. Literally. We ordered our pizza. We're firing up the oven. <laughs> Jason began oh, yeah. custom making your order at 6 35 p.m. on the dot. Oh my god. Who's driving? I don't know. They better tell us that or else I won't trust anyone Stranger that comes to the door. <laughs> Here you go. Keep the chain. Thank you very Thank much. You. Have a good night. you too. Pizza, pizza, pizza. I did film it. <laughs> we did it. Our first time ordering Success. delivery. I Keep saying, the change. I was saying adult thing, but I don't know. I feel like going to get it yourself would be more adult. <laughs> yeah. Saving two dollars. <laughs> Whatever. This is so fun. Can't wait to see our pizzas. They better be perfect. Ooh, Ooh. it is the right sausage. Yay. It's a little skimpy. Uh, Leah, come back. <laughs> we need more. Ooh, this is gonna be so good. Yeah. Good, our sauce is already there. Say, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Cheesy bread. <gasps> oh my gosh, this smells amazing. Hey, you guys. So, I am back from Alyssa's masking again. This is the Leilani mermaid mask. I haven't done this one in a while. It's just really good at like nourishing the skin, but also like exfoliating the skin. It's like a really good combo. Um, but I was gonna just wrap up this vlog and then while I was washing my face and like doing my little routine I was watching Patrice's Thrival and she gave me the sweetest shout out ever. Oh my god. I was like I was like brushing my teeth and like smiling so big. It was so funny I was like texting my mom while brushing my teeth. Go watch Patrice's video. She's so sweet <laughs> and it was 
was just so, so nice. I'll link it below because she has a great haul in addition to her super, super sweet shout out. And yeah, I signed up for Thrive. I have not like placed an order yet, but I'm really excited to, I haven't had time to like search through all the stuff. There's so many things on their website, but um, if you guys are interested in Thrive, definitely check out, why can't I talk? I'm like so crazy right now, Patrice's channel. And she has done at least two hauls with Thrive, which is really, really cool. So uh, yeah, and I have like a coupon link and stuff. I'll link it down below if you're interested. It's for your first order. I get $25 if you sign up th through me, but you don't have to sign up through me. Sign up through Patrice and that would help her out. So yeah, I just wanted to thank Patrice. I'm gonna text her now because that was such a sweet surprise and I can't wait to meet Patrice one day. We are gonna hook up in freaking New York City and take the town by storm. So that is what I'm excited for in the future. But. Like I said, this weekend I'm going to DC. I love going to DC. This is only my second time ever being there, but I absolutely love it. And I've looked up a bunch of restaurants and we're gonna go to the Game of Thrones like pub, the pop-up bar. And we're seeing Coldplay on Sunday. I can't even believe it. So it's just gonna be a really, really fun weekend and I hope to be vlogging it. So you guys should see that next week. But thank you so much for watching. I love sharing my life with you guys. And it's just so amazing to have your support and your friendship. It's overwhelming and so it like fills my heart with so much love so thank you for that and I will see you guys really soon bye